war to my family, my cosmic family. I love my family. You are my family. We ain't gotta have blood, but just know it's all love. I really wanna give you a hug So speak whatever you need to speak You gotta open up your throat chakra You gotta motherfucking release Don't let nobody have that much power over you To where you can't even speak about your shit On your shit Better let them know you got it like that So come on baby to the channel This, of, this is for those of you that don't understand The biggest attack on the goddesses was when they hired all these manipulated entity energies to attack our sons. See, they was already always attacking our sons, but the real attack is on us to hurt us, break us, take from us. But all of this is an illusion. But the greatest attack that they have ever done the most lowest, wickedest, envious attack they have ever done is took the swords from our young gods in return gave them lipstick. This is why I keep my son sheltered from all type of different energies because they allow it to be 100% okay for a man to be G-A-Y. Nothing is wrong with it. I judge no one. I actually like the honesty and the bravery of them individuals that simply get out there and walk out there and be themselves no matter what. But you are under a manipulation spell. See, the higher, the lower down demonic forces, they hate goddesses. The true creators. So they want to make the God feel like he is the woman to go against their mothers. He want them to slow down reproduction because he tired of his motherfucking race that he's been um hijacking bodies. The race he's been hijacking. He's tired of them damn near going extinct. And I speak in him because that motherfucker is a wicked motherfucker. And it's a woman work with him too. The true attack is really on the gay community. Watch in a few years. Mark my words. A lot of men is finna wake up from that gay the feeling of being in a man body but feel like they're a woman. They about to wake up from that spell. A lot of men is finna start saying, man, I don't want this life no more. What, who the fuck am I? I'm supposed to be a god. It ain't that a lot of us was on a, a lot of the men was on a down low growing up. Hell no. Of course we all get curious at one point when we're children on up. Of course we do. We having a human experience. Why not see what it feel like on the other side? But a lot of these men, they just, they, 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 some of them are kind of followers, but y'all don't understand. That's the biggest motherfucking illusion spill they could have ever done to our motherfucking gods was take their swords and return, give them eyeshadow, lipstick, nails, heels, making them feel superior enough that they can wear the energy of a goddess and wear it fine. But it's all an illusion. Our gods are our gods. Now some can be. Because some are, is not he or she. Ashe. But. That was the biggest spell they could have ever done. That was the lowest, wickedest, motherfucking thing they could have ever done. But the attack still not just on you, black man. They want to make the black goddess. The cob and goddess. It don't matter the color no more. The goddess, Period. They wanted to attack her. They see that killing our children wasn't doing shit but sending them back. We don't die. We transcend. And if we're not done here, we'll come back once again. I share. This is for those who probably don't understand what I say about what they're doing to our guys or what they've done. 
<laughs> you got to understand. These hijackers are more afraid of the goddesses than anything. They are afraid of the awakening and anointing that the goddess have within her veins that can awaken these fallen gods. These men that's powerful than a motherfucker. They afraid of it. Because they know. I had a vision. That just came and said make this video. It was a vision of the original goddesses. All colors. Latino goddesses. Black goddesses. White goddesses. African goddesses. British goddesses. You got all these goddesses all over the globe. The true originals. They are going to these little boys and grown men bodies and placing their hands on them. And these men go from being fallen to up. Because the little, the little, the little, I don't know why I just said it. The little, the little, the little. Guess it was meant for me to say that. Because these leads, they understand. They understand because they are always under us. That our greatest motherfucking weapon that we created was a black god. Or a god, a carbon god, a white god, a spiritual god, a British god. They know that it is our biggest weapon. Because they know that god, as soon as that god ass whistle, he will chop off the necks with no remorse. And will be forgiven when it comes to his god ass. That's why they took their swords and put them on an illusion spell to a lipstick. Because they want our gods to fight against us. Because they know our gods is powerful than a bitch. See, y'all be out here, yeah, it's okay to go in our low vibrational conversations. But when it's time for me to speak out of some bakariata no sakat, they know we figuring all this shit out. But they fear the goddess. They all do. Come here, up, 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 money, see me grow up. Our gods is awakening. And I don't give a fuck. I will go. I don't have to be with them. I don't have to lay with them. One conversation awaken that motherfucker. And they know it. Rise up my brother. My sister. My man. My husband. My lover. Rise up. Rise up, rise.